What's good out there everyone? It's Roll Easy here and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be going over a very, very simple duplication glitch, mega easy, and you can be duping cars very, very quickly. All right, so big shout out to the founders, Killer Gaming and Obese Giraffe. So what you're gonna need for this glitch, and please pay attention and listen to this entire intro, you're gonna need one friend and they must not sign in as a CEO or an MC president at all during the session while you guys are duping okay so make sure that we're gonna get into that a little bit more but just to go on the duper needs to start the invite only session and then what you want your friend to do is to sign out of his MC or CEO and then go ahead and accept the invite to go into the dupers invite only session so you want to enter that session not signed in whatsoever okay so apart from that the duper needs a nightclub with a garage and a Benny's vehicle to dupe okay so when I say a Benny's vehicle guys it could be the Nero it could be the Sultan it could be the retro custom I know a lot of you guys are gonna say the t20 is really uh, you know expensive or the deluxe so we can dupe no guys Benny's vehicles those we can dupe the dupes and still get a lot of money it's the most money you can get for a dupe in the game almost a million dollars okay so we don't need custom plates which is huge so that is a great plus no custom plates needed for this glitch also a faggio and a 10 car garage okay it could be a 10 or a 6 or something like that you just don't want that faggio to be inside of the facility inside of your facility or your nightclub so a normal garage now you need the ability to sign in as an mc president so that means you need a clubhouse but apart from that the main thing is you know the stuff with the friend and signing in as an mc or a ceo all right make sure that that does not happen and you can also have an moc if you want to store the vehicle that is an optional uh thing to have for this glitch but it is you know if you guys do want to go ahead and save it in there that is one of your options okay so we're gonna go ahead and get started uh, with today's video. Now, this is me. You wanna go ahead and just grab any car from any garage, okay? It doesn't really matter, you don't lose this car. So just grab any car, go over to Los Santos Customs, all right? Once we've come here to Los Santos Customs, I'm gonna have my friend get in the car. Now, this is what's gonna happen. So my friend is gonna go ahead and hold down on the D-pad and flip to a story mode character right as we're driving into Los Santos Customs, all right? So that's my friend in the top right. You're going to see what they're doing. Hold down on the D-pad and select a story mode character. And now you're on the alert to quit. Okay? So the friend needs to stay on that alert. You as the duper driving, go ahead and just back out of the customs menu and just exit the shop. All right? So now we're outside. Your friend is still on the alert and your friend stays on the alert the whole time. You just want to get out. Now, there's two things that can happen. This, where your friend just sits there in the passenger seat or your friend will slide over to the driver's seat. Doesn't matter which one either one will work okay i've had both happen to me and i've been able to get dupes both ways so don't worry it can happen either way so now you want to open up your motorcycle club menu and you actually want to return vehicle to storage if your friend didn't sign in as an mc or a ceo then your friend will not get kicked out and your car will stay there okay so that's why your friend couldn't get into this session as a ceo or an mc or sign in whatsoever so make sure that doesn't happen now you want to run a little bit far away, open up your motorcycle club menu again, and call out the Fagio that I said that you want in a 10 or 6 or 2 car garage, alright? So I called it out, and if you notice, nothing showed up on the map. That's what you want. And if you look back over here, look, my friend is still stuck inside of the car, still stuck on that alert, okay? So you want your friend to just stay on that quit alert from the character wheel. So what you want to do now is make sure you still don't try to call out any more personal vehicles. Just grab a street car and you want to make your way over to the nightclub, okay? So you remember I said you wanted to have a vehicle to dupe in your nightclub. That would be the LG Retro Custom for me. Could be any other Benny's vehicle for, for you and you don't need custom plates. Okay, so just make your way over to your nightclub and that's the car we're going to be getting. And like I said before, make sure, very important, friend does not, you know, cannot sign in as an MC or CEO at all in this session at any time. Okay, so that means if I wanted to start, you know, helping out my friend, we would need to go into a brand new session because I've been signed in as an MC president. So make sure you have that in mind, okay? Now we're approaching the nightclub. Once we get here, I'm going to get out and I'm going to enter. I think it's garage level B2. I have, I still have a bunch of retros. I still think the 10 car dupe is working for those of you that are interested. Uh, but yeah, I have not tried it in a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and go to B2 right here. I know I have a bunch of retros. So I'm going to grab one of these and I'm going to find one with a custom plate just to show you guys that the plate actually changes and you get a fresh brand new uh, generic plate. 
So I'm gonna grab this retro right here. It has a far crew plate. I'm just gonna simply press R2 or RT and drive it out, all right? So once I drive it out, I'm gonna show you the play right here. This is where you wanna tell your friend now to back off of the alert, okay? So they're gonna back off of the alert as you see in the top right. They'll get kicked out of the car and that car will despawn and then you will notice your plate change right there, okay? It's as easy as that. That's it, only a few steps and this can be done very quickly. It's like a couple minutes each dupe, all right? so. Right now you have two options to save the car. You can go ahead and, like I said before, the optional method, which is the MOC with the personal vehicle storage, or something I find a lot easier, especially if your garage is close to your nightclub like mine is, uh, I put my Faggio in this garage right here. This is the one that I called it out of. So if you have the same situation, if you know where you called out your Faggio, you can drive it to that same garage, and then look, it just fits right into that spot. You see, that's where I had the Faggio. I had two of them right here. Now I only have one because I overwrote that one. So that's how you do it. You could save the car as easy as that. So say you wanted to rinse and repeat. It's as easy as this. Grab, like I said before, any car. So if you have a bunch of different cars in here, I could have even used that retro that I just duped. So grab any one of your personal vehicles and just make your way over to Los Santos Customs where your friend should still be because that's where your friend backed off of the alert. So your friend pretty much just stays over at Los Santos Customs the entire time during the glitch. They don't really have to do much at all. Character wheel and then back off of it. So right here, I drove up. I'm going to have my friend just hop in and we're going to do the same thing over again. My friend is going to go ahead and hold down on the D-pad, flip right, left, or up on the character wheel just to get that alert going as I'm driving into Los Santos Customs, all right? After I hit the door right here. That was happening. That happens when you have two controllers, man. All right, when I'm, when I'm working on two consoles. So like I said before, your friend is on the alert right now and your friend stays on the alert. You simply just back off and get out of the menu inside of the custom shop, hop out, and your friend will, will either slide over or not. Doesn't matter, all right? Open up your interaction menu, hit return vehicle to storage under your MC president menu. Nothing should happen as long as your friend never signed in as an MC or a CEO in this session. Okay, but if your friend is getting kicked out at that point, that's the reason. You guys need to go into a brand new session. All right, so I'm going to open up my MC president menu. I'm going to call it that other Faggio that you saw that I had parked inside of that six car garage right there next to uh, the brand new dupe. So I've done correctly. Once you get a little bit away and try, the call, try to call your Faggio, nothing should show up. That's a good thing. All right, that means it's like glitched out on the map at the moment. So now grab a streetcar. Don't call out any further personal vehicles. Make your way over to the nightclub. And this is where you want to grab another Benny's vehicle. You can grab the same one, actually. You can have the same exact retro there because it will still be there, as you can see right here. I'm going to drive up and I'm, or I'm going to walk up and I'm going to get this one. But if you look on the right, that's the one that I used before with the far crew plate. So I'm going to grab this one. It has a glitching plate on it. And I'm just going to drive out of the nightclub. And this is where you tell your friend to back off of the pause menu. Okay. So you tell your friend to back, or sorry, not the pause menu, the alert. All right. So my friend's going to back off of the character wheel alert. And there we go. All right. Play change just as I anticipated. And I'm going to show you the optional method to save. So I, I could have uh, actually do I? Yeah, yeah, I do. Uh, so I could drive it back into the garage, which is literally right next to where the MOC spawns coincidentally. But I could drive it back into the garage where the Faggio came from, nice and easy. Or like I said, maybe you can't find and you don't know the exact garage you got the Faggio from because it needs to be that exact garage. You can just call out your MOC right here and save it. But uh, remember, every time you go into your nightclub, the MOC will despawn. So you have to worry about that as well. But as you can see right here, I just saved the car and there you go. So you have two ways to save the cars, either the MOC or the garage where you got the bike from, okay? But that's the glitch, guys. Nice and freaking simple, all right? I wanted to get this video out as quick as possible because I don't see this lasting for very long. Uh, this one is a good one, all right? Very, very good, simple two-player glitch. Uh, looks like it should have been in the game forever. I don't know if it's just the nightclub that's allowing us to drive out with those vehicles and the plate change. I'm assuming it might be. But uh, yeah, very, very good glitch. Uh, props to the founders. Shout out to everybody who participated. Uh, shout out to you guys. My name is Roll Easy. Please subscribe to the channel if you're brand new by hitting that big red button. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. Peace out.